We're going to keep this update short. I'm back. Uh, thanks to Rod and Anthony for filling in. Greetings from Trinity Reformed Church in Moscow, Idaho. Uh, I also watched VCB services online and was encouraged by the messages from Rick George and Tyler St. Clair. Since we were not able to do Vacation Bible School this year, our children's ministry has worked with Child Evangelism Fellowship to sponsor five-day clubs, uh, which meet in backyards. We've got two groups uh, going on this week. Uh, here are some pics uh, from that. As mentioned in Tuesday's email, we are partnering with By the Hand Club for Kids on their annual backpack drive. Yet we're doing it differently this year. Rather than having you get the backpack and fill it, we're asking you to donate $25 per backpack and we'll fill it for you. Just go to the events page on the website and claim one, two, three, or more backpacks. Altogether, we're hoping to give over 200 backpacks to needy kids in the inner city. Sunday is supposed to be really hot, so we're having two indoor services this weekend, one Saturday night at 5 p.m. and the other Sunday morning at 9 a.m. Space is limited, so please register online. Remember to bring a mask and to practice physical distancing. Pastor Todd Berge of the Bridge Church in Algonquin will be preaching. Whitestone Resources is the counseling ministry we partner with. Their counselors have offered to put on a Zoom seminar for our church, dealing with the effects of COVID isolation, social unrest, and the gradual return to normalcy. Uh, while we've not yet nailed down the date, it's likely to happen soon, perhaps as early as next Friday, July 24th. We think this will be helpful for the people of our congregation and other interested parties. Stay tuned for more details. We're gearing up for the fall ministry launch we're hopeful the current situation will continue to improve and we will be able to return to some semblance of normality. We'll be rolling out our church's new discipleship plan and seeking to fulfill our mission of making the gospel central to all of life. That's it for this week. See you this weekend, Lord willing.